not going to stay. <laughs> uh, plan B. Do we have a plan B? which means that it's day one of vlogmas day one is going to be prep with me um so you're just gonna see a lot of me pulling stuff in the supplies that i've gathered so far as well as just the general shenanigans of the day so how vlogmas is gonna work uh it seems to work different depending on the person um the basic concept is that from December 1st to December 24th or 25th, you put up one vlog a day. What I'm going to be doing is we are going from December 1st to December 31st. So I have one video planned a day from today to December 31st because I misunderstood when I originally researched <laughs> vlogmas. So that's what we're doing. We're doing uh, December 1st to December 31st. It's going to be one video a day. So there are a couple of videos, including this one, where I will be wearing different clothing because it was filmed over a couple days. I know people say that uh, pre-recording your vlogmas videos is cheating, but I don't care. I'm not waiting until December 1st to put on my decorations. Some of the videos are going to be recorded on the same day. It just seems like a waste of time to wait for the next day. So like, for instance, if I do a bake with me video and I'm going to be decorating the cookies, why would I wait till the next day to actually decorate the cookies for a decorate the cookies with me video. I have a whole list here of things that I'm going to be doing over the course of the next 31 days. It's going to be a fun time. So let's go. So I'm just out back here um, in our little back walkway. I'm just going to grab some firewood to add to our pile. Part of uh, my whole, you know, prep with me uh, video that I wanted to do was just to just uh, kind of go over some of the things that I've gathered for um, Vlogmas. As far as my list is concerned, I don't have everything. Um, there are a couple of small things that I need to get, uh, but mostly this showcase is kind of just going to be um, the arts and crafts side of it. So I'm just going to kind of go over some of the stuff that I've gathered for the month of December and Vlogmas because I think that that's fun and uh, yeah. I was looking for these, I've been looking for them for a while. I love 3D stickers or puffy stickers. Um, and then uh, I did find other stickers that are kind of unrelated, but um, I found some hat. Sorry for the glare. Some cat puffy stickers that are all Christmas themed. And then I did find some dog Christmas stickers that are all Christmas themed. Um, I love animals. If I could have found bird or reptile or fish Christmas themed uh, 3D stickers, I would have gotten them as well, but they don't really make those because those aren't usually conventional pets. Um, so I got those 3D stickers. And then I did pick up these two packs of Christmas themed stickers as well um, because I can't tell you because then that would give away one of the videos that I'm doing. And then I was hoping, I was hoping that when I walked into the dollar store that we'd be able to find some of this stuff. I have uh, different kinds of paper. I have construction paper. I have um, some more scrapbooking um, texturized paper. It's got a lot of glitter, a lot of indents and stuff like that. But I was hoping that when I went into the dollar store that I would find Christmas themed designer paper. These are full sheets. There's 20 sheets, um, two, four, six, eight, ten designs. So two designs, sorry, two sheets per design. They're foiled as well. So um, I was really happy to have found these uh, because they were exactly what I was looking for for what I was going to be doing. So I'm super excited to be working with these, super happy I found them. So another thing that I did, and now we're moving on to the more 3D of the arts and crafts, um, I did find this set of foam rings, uh, which is going to be useful. I did pick up a little strand of garland, it's just the white kind, because I, I wanted a specific kind of look for what I was going for. I did also pick up uh, these little mini packs of uh, Christmas balls. I wanted this one for the different sizes, and uh, I like the different textures in them, so that's all gonna get incorporated together very nicely. If you couldn't tell, I do have like a gold and red 
kind of theme going on. I think that those are very royal colors, very Christmas based. I mean, I, I, I do like the traditional green and red, but there's just something about incorporating gold into that that just, and, and silver, uh, gold and silver, uh, that just kind of makes it all come together. Mwah. I got some multicolored ribbon. Uh, which is great. I have some ideas for this. Um, I'm not sure what all is going to pan out, so I'm hoping that my ideas aren't a little too far-fetched as far as what I want to get accomplished with that, as well as these have this pack of little mini Christmas presents. So, And then last but not least, I don't know what I'm doing with these yet because I kind of bought them on a whim. I have ideas for what uh, they could be incorporated into, but honestly, if I don't like the look of it, then I'm stuck with them. Pine cones. They're silver glitter dusted. Very, very messy. We don't, I don't do a lot of glitter in the house um, for that reason because it gets everywhere. So, so that stuff's been set aside for now. Um, of course, it's still early yet to be doing a lot of it. But the next thing that I wanted to showcase uh, that kind of gives away one of the video ideas is I did pick up a gingerbread house kit. When I was younger, this was kind of a staple in my house. When I was growing up with my mom, um, she did work a lot, and so um, time was limited. She did do her best, and I'll always appreciate that, but there were a lot of, you know, empty nights where you come home and, and uh, mom wasn't home, and I just kind of had to occupy myself, and to a degree, I did enjoy that. I did get to do a lot of my own thing. I didn't have to worry about looking after siblings or the annoyingness of other family members. Um, but I did enjoy doing the so-called group activities uh, whenever we could. So we used to always pick up a gingerbread house kit from the store and we'd spend a day or two just putting it together. And uh, it would just kind of sit on display and I would kind of steal candies as it got closer to Christmas off of it. And uh, the last gingerbread house I made uh, was probably 10 years ago. So I'm really eager to get back into this. There have been a couple of things that have happened today. I'm not going to show you my dirty dish counter. Um, so we brought the Christmas bins in finally. All three of them. And um, now I'm going to be making dinner, which is just some pasta with some sauce. It's Thursday. So on Thursdays, my fiance has this habit where he goes to local thrift stores and we find a few things that we like. Usually only a couple dollars each. Usually we end up spending about anywhere from 10 to $20. It's an opportunity to get out of the house. Hi, Maxie. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I don't got anything for you. You guys know that game Space Invader? This is kind of like that. Okay. So Vlogmas Day 1 is going up super late. We were out super late uh, doing some things. I did get this octopus tripod for only a couple bucks because I, the holding my arm out is really tiring and it's hard to get a good angle. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and test it out. Oh, a little suction cups. That's really cute, but I feel like that's gonna get in the way. <laughs> ah, and then I could suction cup it to a surface. That's actually not a bad idea. Oh, okay. I'm just the. I'm just just stupid. <clears throat> I don't like that this part is plastic, but we'll see. I can angle it if I want. I don't want to strip it, so that's probably good enough. Oh, it's retractable, so it holds on, and it's a little grippy. Okay, but it's a little grippy. That's cute. Okay, so there's a bit of finessing. That is so much easier, and I could just set it up anywhere, and it's stable 
let's set her up. <laughs> Don't need a view of my trash can. Hello! Head empty. <laughs> awesome, okay, cool. Cool, awesome. Oh, that's amazing. I love it. Awesome. All right, guys, that's going to do it for Vlogmas Day 1. Tomorrow will be Day 2, and we'll be doing Clean With Me, in which you will see me go about just cleaning the crap out of my house because it really needed it, and I have nothing better to do with my time because I am currently unemployed. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow.